Hello and welcome to my first ever attempt at making a devlog and the desperate attempt of mine to be more entertaining to watch than a regular game of golf, which shouldn't be too difficult. And with the 2016 game music in the background, we can get started. Um, so, a couple months back I started to work on a project involving country walls. Um, if you don't know what country walls are, um, country walls are basically personifications of countries, but it's walls. Um, simple as that. Um, but be careful, they can only have eyes, never at a mouth or eyebrows or anything like that. The community will be in flames. Anyways, the project originally started off to be just practice, but I decided to put some more effort into it and turn it into an actual game and make a devlog about it. Um, so that's why I'm here. Um, so, what is the project supposed to be? Well, um, you play country balls and shoot in an arena, and that's literally everything I thought about um, until now. Um, here you see the arena, um, the ball has some gun, enemies can spawn, and I didn't quite figure out the rest. Um, I thought about going with some sort of space station theme, um, we will see about that. Since I started with this like um, several months ago and I didn't actually record back then, um, you will only see the new footage. I made country balls, so I had something to work with first. This means that um, please welcome to the arena, Canada. The USA the UK and Jamaica, because why not? Um, I also added eyes, which is kind of cute, isn't it? So in the game, um, I added basic buttons, many of which um, don't work yet, so I kind of have to fix that. And I also drew several textures like this box and spike. Uh, yeah. I then proceeded to use my artistical genius to make this gun and this very detailed projectile. And all smashed together into a map, it looks like this. Uh, this white ball is supposed to be an enemy, um, although it doesn't really do anything right now. Um, making the movement, however, turned out to be the most annoying thing I have ever done. And it took me ages to figure out a way to align the gun to the mouse and simultaneously rotate the eyes according to the mouse position. Don't ask me why. Um, anyways, this is how it turned out in the end, which is pretty neat. Um, I also gave it the ability to jump and walk because I, it is kind of important. And next up were some uh, cute animations. I wanted to make the ball feel squishy, and so I changed its size properties along the axis, and this is the result. Um, I also gave the boxes and everything a rigid body. Furthermore, I added those spikes which damage the player, except, except the player can't die yet, so the health kind of just turns negative. Anyways, I also made these floating platforms which break after half a second once the player touches them. Which is kinda neat, isn't it? Afterwards, I designed a main menu which doesn't do much, but you can access a skin shop, which is great. Um, this skin shop took me ages to make and um, to figure out how to make, but you can now purchase skins, which is great. And last but not least, I added a simple gun. Um, I don't even want to get started on the pain this caused me, but it kind of works, thanks to the help of Mr. Blackthorn Prod right here. However, the projectile destroys itself over time and not yet after a collision, so I will have to fix that in the future. Um, oh yeah, and it also has particles and all. Um, yeah, so this was my first devlog, kind of short, I know, um, I'm not really experienced with this. I'm just planning more in the future, and um, if you liked the video, please leave a like. If you disliked it, you can leave a dislike, or hack this YouTube channel to delete the video. Have a good day.